In this video, we're going to look at sessions. Sessions in GoGuardian are how you monitor your student's activity. So to set up a session for a certain class, you're going to click on the tile for that class. So I'm going to click on the 6G technology class that I just created. When it pops up, click settings on the left hand menu. When you go into settings, you'll see the classroom name and any other settings that you set up. You can also update those there if you'd like to, but we're going to look at scheduling. Scheduling is where you can schedule sessions to monitor the activity of your students. So to add a session, we're going to go down to the green button and click add schedule. I'm going to start my session. My class starts at 8 a.m. and ends at 8.45 and my class is on Thursdays. After you choose the beginning time, ending time, and the day, you'll click Add Schedule. And now I have a scheduled session for this class, 6G Technology, on Thursdays from 8 to 8.45 a.m. On this page, you can also look at reporting which is where you can decide if you would like to get emails of when a session has been recorded. Now we're going to go back to our class and we'll take a look that under settings, I can view sessions and here's a list of all of the sessions that I have recorded previously when I administered this class. If at any time you would like to edit a session that you've set up to record, you can come over to the far left menu and go Guardian and click on the calendar. Here is where you will see all of your sessions that you have set up. So I'm going to go to next week with this button on the right that says next and I will see my upcoming classes. Here if I want to edit a class you simply click on the edit under that class. And I could change the times if that class had changed times for that day for some reason, or I could add another day if that was a schedule change as well, and then click Save Changes. So now I'm going to go back over to the left menu and click on our classes, and we're back to the dashboard where we started. So in this video, we learned how to schedule a session to record, and also how to access a recorded session afterwards.